you might understand it more now. We walk down our ancestors' path on a fine low tide day in August, knowing that crabs were waiting for us, big tasty ones. My dad knew every hole and crevice below the slippery rocks. As we approached the grand gates of the big house, I heard the sad howling of hunting dogs behind the high wall of the orchard. Dad opened the gate and walked purposefully across the concrete yard towards a field of potatoes, the sea blue horizon blinding. Keep close behind me and don't be afraid. A gamekeeper stepped out of the shadow, two dead pheasants, a flaccid buckle on his belt. You again, there is no path. A stream of sweat flowed down my back and I hid my face in my father's coat flaps. The window opened three floors above our heads and the major roared down from the big house. I spied a shotgun by his side and the red scar of his mouth spitting words through his handlebar moustache. Is that you again, Parry? If so, through you go. Don't hang around. My father nodded a fake thank you, but kept his flat cap on tight. The gamekeeper shuffled back to the shadows, tail between his legs. Come on now, Parry, keep right behind me. The Major's binoculars will be watching. Any excuse not to let us back next year? So there you go. Pretty simple. Yechavar.